It is a photograph that is making its way around the world, reminding everyone of the power that one random act of kindness can have between a policeman and a man who had no shoes. A New York City police officer on a frigid November night in Times Square, bending down to give a homeless and shoeless man a pair of brand new boots. This scene would have gone unnoticed, except Jennifer Foster, a tourist, just happened to be there. I heard him quite clearly say, I have these size 12 all weather boots for you. Let's let's take care of you. She surreptitiously snapped this picture and sent it to the NYPD, along with a note saying the officer expected nothing in return and did not know I was watching. I was never so impressed in my life. The department posted the picture to Facebook, where it got about 2 million views and more than 500,000 likes. It's been passed around the globe from Romania to Russia to China. And yesterday, the officer himself came forward. His name, Lawrence DePrimo, a 25-year-old who still lives with his mom and dad. So I went up to him. I was like, buddy, I was like, where's your socks? Where's your shoes? He's like, I never had a pair of shoes. It's okay, officer. I said, but God bless you. So I knew right then I needed to help him. When you presented him with the boots, mm -hmm. what was his reaction? He couldn't believe it. Uh, he's like, this is too much, officer. You know, he's like, God bless you and be safe and everything. And uh, like I said, it was almost like you just gave him a million dollars. Officer DePrimo doesn't know anything about the man he helped or what's become of him, but he keeps the receipt for the $75 he spent on those boots in his bulletproof vest. A reminder, he says, that even when things are tough, some people have it tougher. Only would have been better if it was Christmas Eve. I mean, yeah. it's... It, you, you, you know what? Uh, and uh, people remember that, not just about the cop here, but in the season itself. Mark, thank you so much. Have a great weekend. Andrew, Dominic, yourself as well. It's going to wrap it up. We'll see you here Monday at 6 p.m. Till then.